Yo, my name is Benjamin, and in this video, I'd like to cover an update to the Quick Actions menu in Framer. You can now also insert components directly from this menu, which is especially useful within larger projects. As a refresher, you can also use this menu for specific actions or to quickly navigate around your own project. I can bring it up with Command K, type a slash and then use the arrow keys to select a page. And starting today, I can also now use this menu to quickly insert components either on the canvas or directly on my page. Let's have a look. For example, let me quickly grab the about card. I'll hit enter to add it onto the canvas and then I can put it next to my desktop breakpoint. Keeping it here can be useful for later reference or to later add it to a carousel, ticker or slideshow. And yes, we can also still use this menu to actually edit the component. So if I hit enter, this brings me onto the component canvas where I could add variants and more. Let me jump back to the home page and let's take a look at how we can insert components directly onto our layouts. So here we have a simple collection list and a horizontal stack within it. With the stack selected, I'll bring up the quick actions menu. I'll type link and I can now add any of the links within my project. I'll select the one with the arrow and just like that, it gets added onto our stack. This makes it very easy to quickly add components to your existing layouts. In larger projects, your assets panel might look a little something like this. A long list of components where it can be hard to find the right one or you might not want to switch to the assets panel at all. You might have the layers panel open and want to stay focused on your layout design. This is exactly why we added the ability to insert components directly from the quick actions menu making it much easier to find and quickly add components onto your page. I can also type in the action keyword, in this case insert, to get a list of all insertable components. And I can do the same thing for the edit action. Using this method, we can also find the about card that we inserted earlier on to quickly jump back to its component canvas. And that's pretty much it for this update video. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more updates coming soon.